There we go. Here we go. We got it, boys. We got it. Let's go. go. Fire's getting out of control, bro. Bro, what do we do? This was a stupid idea, dude. Dude, what do we Why do? Why are we in here? Dude. Yee, guys, welcome back. And yes, you saw that title. We are bringing back the 24-hour overnight challenges. We seen your comments. That's pretty much at least half the comments. Literally 99.9% .9 of them yeah. say do it overnight. So we had hours. to bring it back. We've been planning this one for since we bought this house. We live on a lake, if you guys didn't know. We've made forts on the lake, but we've never spent the night. So the other day we went to Walmart. We bought a bunch of air mattresses and a bunch of cardboard and material to deck this fort out. We're gonna be making a fort and spending the night on the lake. But it's not just gonna be spending the night out there and just sleeping. We're nah. gonna be cooking up some stuff. We're gonna be- Maybe even go a little fishing, you know? Yeah. Might go in the fish. And pop a picture up right here. This was in our lake. That's a 10 foot gator that just chills out there. IBD took a picture of that. So hopefully you don't run into that bad boy. We might, if he pops our air mattresses and one we hit, go down. Hit him with the one hit, right? I'll, I'll hit him with the one hit, okay. but he's probably gonna get one of us. Hopefully it's your boy over there. No, bro. Yes. Before we start making the fort, I got something to show him. What? Yes. I don't even know about this. Yep, yep. Boom! Oh! Overflage merch. We had this out last year, but it sold out so fast. So a lot of you guys didn't get the chance to get it just in time for St. Patrick's Day. So if you want it, get it now, because this is probably the last time we'll ever have this merch available. If you like it, if you like it, the link is in the description. Can it protect us from the gator though? That's the real question. Oh no, it won't protect you from the gator, but oh, it'll keep shoot. us warm on the waters. Oh, that's, that's key, that's so key. So we're gonna go up there in the grass and start building. Oh, bro, this is stinking bad, bro. I didn't think it was gonna bounce, dude. It's fine, it's fine. We got all four beds right here, but they are not connected. What we're gonna do is take this rope, wrap them around and tie them together to make sure that they don't come apart while we're at sea, because look at these waves. And an extra precaution we got is this waterproof duct tape. We're gonna wrap this around as well, just to make sure they don't separate, because if they separate, the whole thing done. Oh, there we go. It's looking big, dude. Bro, this is about how many square feet is this? I'd say a solid uh, probably 500,000 at least. So now that we got our island set up, it's looking really sturdy. Like, give it a nice kick. Boom. Dude, don't kick it. Boom. Don't. We're looking good. Dude, we oh. already had one stinking hole that we had to fill. Oh, yeah, we did. Right. We did. I was just casually walking, had a knife in my hand, tripped. Boom, right there. But X marks is fine. No, no, no. Stop, stop, stop. It's all good right now because we have it water sealed with duct tape. And now we're gonna construct the fort. I think the plan is we're gonna build the fort on the backside and then have a giant front yard so we can play games. And we have a fire pit that we're gonna try to bring on to the beds and light a fire in the middle of the water. Probably a dumb idea because if that thing catches our foreign fire, we're screwed. Hey, but there's a lot of water to put it out just in case. The foundation is solid, but we need flooring to cover up the cracks because if we're on there, a little wave hits us, look at that. Everything falls through the cracks, we lose everything. And that should prevent all of the huts. And just like that, we have a nice solid floor. Constructed the fort. We're gonna go with calling this thing the barn because that's what it looks like. We got windows right here on the outside. The sun is already setting, so we're actually gonna set sail, try to make it the whole night. This thing is already starting to deflate though. These beds are getting very- Not the best yeah. beds. And then over here, we have a supply box. We're gonna load this into the fort, inside the fort. We also got some life jackets. Just in Just case we sink, cause there's a high chance we will. No dude, 0% chance. That's not gonna happen. We're gonna be successful. <laughs> Hopefully, but man, it is not looking too good. Gotta get out there before the sun goes fully down. It's 6.55 right now. We're gonna try to make it to at least morning. This man's got school tomorrow, so I don't know what he's gonna do about that. Because once we're out there, we ain't coming back in. I don't know, I just set an alarm on my phone or something. I'm gonna have to swim we, back to shore. Yeah, you're gonna have to swim, because that thing, once it's out there, 
It's gonna be hard to move back in. This thing's heavy as heck. All right, I don't even so know we're gonna get this in the water. The plan is you're going in and then I'm pushing off because you know, I okay. got the... You know. As we were making our way to the water in the marsh area, the whole thing collapsed because it's pretty windy outside and for Florida, it's pretty cold too. What is it like? 39? Like, I think it's in the high 30s right now. It's pretty cold. I'm gonna be sitting on the beds and Nick's gonna be pushing all of them into the water. This is where we set sail. Once we go in the lake, we are not coming back to shore until tomorrow. I'm on the front side of the raft. I'm not ready, but this is as ready as I'm ever gonna be. So just give it a nice big push. Oh, oh, oh here we go. Okay, oh, here we go. Yo, yo. Yo, get on, get on. My feet are in the water. You got it, you have to send it. I have to do it for the boys. Keep pushing, Bro, we're not out yet. My feet are in the water. Stinking oh, he's soaked. in, he's soaked. That's gonna be miserable. But you gotta do it for the boys. Okay, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I'm in the lily pad, so we're pretty far oh. out. Get on. No, we're not, we're not out yet. I'm oh, dude, he's so deep. Look, dude. Oh, he's, oh, that's bad. <laughs> we're just oh, starting dude. overnight. He's wet and cold. One of the worst combinations that you can be. No, dude. Huh? We're really out here. Now. We're out here, boys. Bro, oh, I'm afraid the gator is gonna come bite me, dude. I know. I'm terrified. Dude, the gator we saw, man, or I didn't even see it. IBD saw it. He said it got pretty close to our dock and it was eight to ten feet long. Yo, where are we setting up camp? I'd say, dude, just get to the middle of the lake. Get to the middle of the lake? Because the gator's like staying on the shore. This is like perfect gator territory, right in that little marsh area. Onto the middle! <laughs> Heave! <laughs> Heave! <laughs> Heave! <laughs> hours later we made it to the middle of the lake our house is way over there way down there you see those lights that is it but first thing we got to do before we even set up the fort is we brought a 10 pound anchor and bro that's just a 10 pound weight i know no no it's an anchor specifically made for this you can see right there it says anchor you see <laughs> tie this around right here and we should be good to go and to make sure we don't lose the anchor i think i'm gonna tie it to nick's ankle no yes bro because then either we lose you and we lose everything or we lose nothing no dude no okay fine heave oh oh perfect perfect yes is it on the bottom yes it's on the bottom right now ricky is tying the anchor to the side of the raft on one of the ropes that we tied around it holding it all together we're good to go Hopefully my knot's good or else we're screwed, but I think it's time to set up the fort. Hopefully I don't break this thing. Ugh. Here we go. Ugh. Oh, just like oh. that. Boys, we're good to go. Is there room for me in there? Plenty of room. We got, dude, we got, oh my gosh. Dude, come in. This is what we're working with in the fort. We got a little bit more to add as the night goes on, but we got the cooler right here. We got the life jackets, the four windows. The carpet and the worst, most poorly designed door ever, which leads right out into the water. But there is a little narrow gap way if you want to make it to the yard where Nick is staying. <clears throat> On the yard, we have the fire pit with some firewood, the two paddles, a fishing rod for later, just in case we need a little bite to eat. Oh, we're definitely going to need a grub, dude. I'm hungry right now. Okay, we haven't had dinner yet. Okay, okay. We got the buggy board, an extra line of escape just in case the gator does indeed come and sink our raft. There's only room for one person on there, so if the gator comes, I will be taking it. And, uh, and then I will be taking it from him. I don't know what Nick's thinking, but man, I am a little bit hungry. Maybe not for a full meal, but I did bring a little snack. Wait. Yep, marshmallows. Marshmallows? Yep. So I think we're gonna try to start that fire. Ooh. and uh, cook out here on the lake. Should we bring the fire pit in the fort? I think so. Do you see what the fort is made out of? This is what we call cardboard, highly flammable. I know, but I'm, you about, I'm, I'm, about, I'm about taking the risks, you know? It feels, I don't know how it feels out there, but it's pretty warm and toasty in here. And then exactly. we can cook if it up. warm and toasty in there, we should warm up the outside. No, I say put it outside and be safe. I say we risk it. Come on. Hey, let's uh, risk it. Let's okay, okay, <laughs> bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. Place it, place it, place it. Yo, 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 just place it down, place it down, place it down. You're good. Ooh. All right, all right. We did actually bring a lighter so we can start this. No, dude, we don't, I don't think we need the lighter, man. Just take your jacket off, I'll take mine, rub them together, and the fire should start. Is the merch just so hot or what? Yeah, dude, yes. 
For real? Yeah, give me your jacket. Oh. All right, now come in, come in. This is so sketchy. Crossing over the middle, there's a giant gap where my arm can just go straight into the water. All right, I'm on the main raft. It's pretty narrow. Oh, dude, it's way warmer in here. It's pretty warm, right? Dude, it is nice and toasty. All right, here we go. According to the ancient scriptures, they say when one IBP merch touches another, what happens? It ignites a spark, which can be used to start a fire. It was just an ancient Chinese scripture that I read one time, like in fourth grade. So it, it might not work, but they said just touch and rub. Ah! Bro, 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 stop, 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 stop. What? You're doing it wrong. What? Red goes on the right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how. Okay. Should I rub even more aggressively? More aggressive. You, okay. you were going soft. Okay. Ah! 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 Oh, 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 oh. Bro. Dude. That, bro, that Chinese scripture was a lie, man. I'm using the lighter. Yeah, bro, just use the lighter. Do you not know how to use a lighter, dude? There we go, there we go. Oh, oh, we got fire. Oh, we got fire. We got fire. Fire. Ooh, ha, ha. Bro, it went out. Give it to me. All right, fine. <laughs> dude, you gotta get the leaves. You can't get the moss. Moss yeah. just smokes, dude. Yeah. Anyone who's been camping knows that. See, let's see. Oh, there we go. Here we go. We got it, boys. We got the fire. Go! Yo, 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 sticking, yo keep, it, keep it alive. Keep it alive. Okay, there we go. We're cooking. We're cooking. We're cooking. Oh, dude, that's how you do it right there. Hopefully, it doesn't catch this whole thing on fire, if man. It catches this whole thing on fire. Then what do we do? I don't know. Oh my, dude, it's so smoky. This is a bad idea. This was a bad idea. This was oh. a bad idea. Oh my. All right, let me cook my marshmallow real quick. Here. Bro, this fire is getting it out of control, bro. All right, here we go. Oh my. Cook it. Cook it. Cook it. Just like good old days. Look. Gotta camp. get it toasted. Marshmallow oh. over the flame. Oh, dude, this fire is getting big, dude. Oh, this is not good. This is bad. This is bad. This is this really is, bad. Like, not good. Bro, what do we do? This was a stupid idea, dude. Dude, what, what are we why doing? Why are we making it here? Dude, shoot, 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 shoot. Dude, this is actually really bad. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, oh, dying down, dying down. Oh, oh, it's so smoky. It's getting real close to the cardboard, dude. If one of the cardboards catch on fire, we're, we're done. So don't try this at home. Look at my pants. They're covered in ash. Here we go. Marshmallow's getting toasted. Just cook your marshmallow until we can put it out, bud. I am, I am, I am. I am. The light going brown. Here we go. Going brown. We go, boys. It's on fire. A little more cook and we should be good. Give it like 30 more seconds. Still Ooh. Good? No, I think a little more, bro. Okay, a little more. It's looking good, right? I think that's good. Oh no no. Oh. A little more? Okay. Oh, I think that, I think that, I think it's good. Okay, it is. It's yeah, good. It's good. It's good. 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 Oh. Perfect. Kind of like it dripping. Nice and golden brown. Not even like burnt or anything, right? Mm -mm, I love it like this. All right, take a bite. Okay. Okay. You just trying to throw it? No, no, no. I was gonna eat what? it. What? I was gonna eat it. I'm Bro! I'm eating it. I'm eating it. I'm eating it. I made that fire so you could cook a marshmallow so I'm you could eat it. it. I'm eating it. Watch, watch. Ready? You don't waste food. Mmm. Ooh. <laughs> Can you taste the smoky fire feel? Mmm. -hmm. It has like that. That home cooked feel. Ooh. Yeah. Mmm. You want one? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Perfect timing, man. It was like a one time use. Cooked that marshmallow and then it put itself out. All, all of our kindling got burnt to ashes though. So that's pretty much our only means of starting the fire. Yeah, yeah, the fire's done. We ain't making another fire. That's it. I'm just glad the whole thing is still standing. You hear that? The fire pit melted to the boogie board. Oh my, it burned a hole. We're gonna dispose of the fire properly because fires can always reignite later on in the night and we don't want that happening. So you do the honors of getting rid of this stuff. Look left, look right. <laughs> It's 8.01 right now. That marshmallow is going to hold me over for a little bit. But Nick got nothing to eat, so he might have to go fishing later. But I do have another surprise, bro. It's okay. <laughs> what, tell me. I got another surprise in what, the corner. What, what, what? Food, food, food? No, this Hot one's... Hot dogs? Nope, nope. This one's not edible. But I got LED lights to deck this place out. Color changing, too. I don't know how they work, but if we get this to set up, it's going to be better than our house back at home, man. Match later it took me a long time indeed it did but unlike the fire i actually got the job done boom boom oh yeah boys Ooh, look at that man oh my they changed colors yeah dude this is insane this is actually like this is like vibes bro. yeah like look at this dude oh and then, my. And, then, and then guess what you know what makes it even better boom another one so i'm gonna put it on this side it's gonna be the whole place Ooh. Adam, do a Oh, we looking crispy! Much, much later. Ooh -hoo -hoo! 
Oh. Look at this place. Oh my dude. dude it's looking this is good. looking clean, bud. We need these every fort we do. We need these. We do. It just makes it feel a lot more premium, you know? The sun has already set. It's almost nine o'clock. And I don't know if fish actually sleep, but if they do sleep, they're probably gonna go to sleep soon. So we gotta go out there, throw a few casts, and see if we can catch anything. He, at he all. still hasn't eaten yet, man. Yeah, I'm really I, hungry. I haven't eaten since lunchtime. Oh! What? Dude, there's such a big gap right there. Bro, we're gonna get separated. Alright, you fish from over there, I'm staying over here. Okay. I hope that gator just doesn't come out of the water, man. Do you have bait or no? No bait, no bait. Should we use a marshmallow? Yeah, marshmallow. Okay. <sighs> Never used a marshmallow as bait before, but it's the only thing we got out here, so. Sweet, dude, I think the, the fish shark. are gonna like it. Save, some, save it for the fish, man, come on now. Farther you go, the bigger the fish, that's what they say. What is this fishing pole? What? There's not even like a really thingy? Is there even a line? Dude, did you not check before we get up? You're not eating tonight. You're not eating, dude. That's just how it's gonna be. I'll catch him with my hands. You're gonna catch a fish with your bare hands? The heck do you think you are? I'll be bad grills. And when it's a matter of survival, I'm willing to do anything that it takes. Even if it means catching a fish with my bare hands. No pun intended. For the grab, he goes for the grab. Whoa! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. we oh, caught him, we oh caught him. My. Sank get that neck, bro, oh I ain't catching no fish. I don't think there's even fish out here. Yeah, there's no fish, dude, they're all sleeping. Or they're hiding from the gator. All I know is you ain't eating tonight. Sorry, man, I'm going back in. <laughs> no food for me, so. Like Stop being a baby, dude. Bro. Should have checked the fishing line, man. I just wanted to catch a little fish. But now, I'm back inside. I think I'm just gonna take a nap, but there's a little problem. These lights that we got, uh, we kind of lost the remote. I think they went in the water. So, the lights are just gonna stay on while I take this little nap and think about food. Good night, y'all. Yo, I'm taking a nap and I hear Sounds like water. What the heck? Ricky! What? What are you doing? Oh, I gotta go, man. I gotta go. Dude, are you just peeing off the edge? Yes. Where else am I gonna go, man? We don't have a bathroom. That's the one thing we don't have in here is a bathroom, man. You gotta take a number two. I don't know what you're gonna have to do, man. I can't take a number two because I have no food to poop out, dude. <laughs> Why are you gonna joke like that? <laughs> Do you really want food, dude? Uber eats it out here, man. Uber eats? Uber eats it to the house, get IBD to paddle out here and deliver us the food. One minute, 37 seconds later. Just place my order. Yo, boy, get us some grub tonight. Let's go! I'm gonna let the whole lake know that I'm getting food, okay? Okay. I got Uber Eats, baby! Let's go! Oh my, you hear that echo? Yeah. Our neighbor's probably gonna get mad. The boys just called, they're down at the, uh, they're spending the night in the middle of the lake and they called Uber Eats, so I'm gonna get the Uber Eats at the door here and take it down to the dock. Let me get this little dinghy, I'm gonna take that down. The Uber Eats got here at about 9.40, show them what time it is right now. Time is currently 10 o'clock, just about. And so, our dad is still not making it out here yet. I don't know what's taking him so long. Meanwhile, at the Krusty Krab. IBD is getting in the boat right here. Oh, oh my gosh, goodness. leaking. Oh shoot. Whoa. He is down there, I see a light. Yo, dad! Oh my gosh. Dude. Oh, that ain't gonna work. 3,000 years later. <laughs> It's 10.29 right now, and our dad is finally making his way out here. I don't know what he's on, if he fixed the boat, but there's a bright light, that's him. He's making his way down. On the way! Woo! 
Where is he on? Who is that? Little raft? He's on a tiny little raft with a bucket full of everything. So close, but yet so far. IDD delivery. Come on, man. You're almost here. What are you what doing? Are you doing? He's drifting away. Yo, get it. Go get it. Go get it, Nick. Okay, here. Oh, he's got a care package full of stuff. Oh my. All right. Thank you, IBD. See you in the morning. The moment we have all been waiting for. It's a grub, grub. sesh, boys. Nice little burrito. Oh, mm. Aluminum and all. Oh, how good does that taste? <gasps> you forgot to take that wrapper off, too. What's he doing? Oh my, uh oh. Right now it is 11.01 in the morning and as you guys know, I got school tomorrow so I gotta get up at five in the morning. Our last light just went off. This one on my other side has been out for a bit. I'm going to bed right now though. Normally in overnights we stay up pretty late but this one, it's different because I got school. So we'll see y'all in the morning. He's going to bed, <clears throat> but your boy is gonna stay awake for a little bit. I'm just gonna look out this window until it gets super late. Cause I love just looking out windows and look how much you can see. Just look at that. Look at the view. What is that? Incredible view. Easy work's going to bed. Easy work, bro. I got school. I know, man. I know, I know. Put the grind and the And gold. I got something planned for later. What? Are you gonna prank me? Just go to bed, dude. You need that sleep for school, okay? All right. I mean, I'm going to bed too. All right. It's 3 a.m. right now. We're still on the lake. Somehow this thing has not sunk in yet. This man right here is still asleep. Got school in a couple hours, but I can't let him off the hook. I got a little prank up my sleeve. He thought that our lights were dead earlier. But little did he know, I was turning them off with the remote I had under my butt cheeks. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna turn both of the lights to red. And then, I'm gonna make him think that this whole thing got caught on fire because I wanted to toast another marshmallow. Change this thing to red. Oh, look at that. In three, two, one. Yo, bro, 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 Dude, there's a fire, bro. I accidentally shot the fire out, man. Get off, get off. Dude, get off, jump off the ship, man. Hurry. Bro, where? Dude, hurry. Where's the fire? It's all out there. It's coming this way. It's spreading this way, dude. Where? Come on. Where? Right out there, bro. Hurry, just jump in, man. Bro, where's the, there's no fire, yes, is there? Yes, dude, there is. Come on, there's no time to wait. How? I threw all the wood off. This is not even a fire. Fine, no. I'm going back to bed, dude. Dang, that was a big hut. Ginormous this hut. Work. I thought this would work, like, cause look. The red. Yeah, but you know what happens? Look. I open my eyes and boom, the first thing I see is the lights. Oh my. Guys, my alarm just went off. It's 5.34 in the stinking morning. The sun is not even out yet. It's still like pitch dark outside, but I have to go to school. Ricky is still asleep over here. I probably got like, maybe like an hour of sleep. It was so cold. Just tossing and turning the whole night, but I'm about to phone my dad and let him know he's got to pick me up. I'm leaving one hit Rick on his own. IVD's almost here. Oh. Yo, I'm, I'm better. I'm, I'm better. I'm better leave. Time for school. Okay. See you, bro. I brought you something. Where do you bring me? Look behind you. What is that? Kayak. You brought the kayak? I brought the kayak. So I'm getting the kayak? You get the kayak, yeah. Ooh. 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 <laughs> so long, Sluber! There he goes. There's the boys. Off to school. 6.09. I think I'm just gonna go back to bed until the sun rises. It's starting to rise right now. And I actually want to stay on the lake and see this amazing view. I mean, look at that. Got us breakfast, boss. No way. What? Oh. Oh, man. It is bright outside. The sun has not fully come up, but most of the way it has. 
Woke up to IBD screaming he caught a fish, but as you saw right there, he couldn't finish the job. Man's let it go before he could get it. Look at this right here. Look how deflated that air mattress is and that air mattress is. So if we made the fort on there, we would have been in the water for sure. I gotta pull up the anchor or else I'll just be paddling in place. And after this, I should be home free. Ugh. Oh. Now I just gotta paddle in a little bit and I'll be home sweet home. He's almost all the way in. It was way out there in the middle yesterday. It. Yo, it actually popped. Get on the other, get on the other one, man. Yo, what? <laughs> no, it Dude, you better move. You're about to go underwater. After all that, made it to shore. Yeah, you Finally. ain't on shore yet, dude. I know. I'm gonna make it right here. <sighs> probably took about 30 minutes to paddle in, even though we were only probably 100 yards out in the water. Finally made it, but look at this thing now. Only one bed is still inflated fully. These two over here deflated, and that one completely done. Fort's on its side, we're in shambles. I'm gonna go inside, get some actual rest in a normal bed, and wait till Nick comes home from school. Thanks so much for watching guys. If you enjoyed it, drop a like down below. If you want to see more overnights, comment where else we should do them. We love you guys. And until, until next time. Throw it? Huh? Oh, dang it. I Dude, missed. Come on. Bro, my oh. bad. Oh, no. We ballin', yeah, we ballin', yeah, we ballin'. We poppin', yeah, we poppin', yeah, we